You know, Tina's here not just because of the cosmetic problem she's had. Her issues, obviously, much deeper than just her skin. Her health conditions have left her with pain. It's difficult for her to walk. We actually sent her to foot and ankle specialist, Dr. Kasrobadi, and celebrity dentist, Dr. Madahi, for a much needed diagnosis. I see that there's a lot of teeth that are missing. Tina's mouth is one of the worst cases I've ever seen. Number one is missing, two is missing, three is missing, seven is missing, 12, 13 missing, 14, 15, 16, 17 is missing. Close. You hear a clicking noise? Because you have had so many missing teeth for so long, there's a bit of a joint damage. Yeah, there's a broken filling here. Uh -huh. yeah. Worst case scenario is there's just not enough bone to support the existing teeth that she has, and we have to pull more teeth. I really need a lot of work done. I didn't think it was that bad. I'm afraid of being with no teeth. And I don't want, I don't want to have to lose more. I've never been to a podiatrist. I'm really embarrassed <laughs> that anybody see my feet. Tina's feet are in very bad shape. I can only imagine how much pain she's been in the past 10 years. Does it hurt right in this area? Very painful. So you're dealing with two separate issues. You have fungus in the toenails, and then um, you're suffering from the condition called the bunion on both feet. This right foot, if you leave it untreated, it will eventually become like your left foot. That's so, scary. I don't know if you are a smoker or you've been a smoker before. 32 years. 32 years. And I just stopped in July. When you are a smoker for that many years, the lack of oxygen makes the toenails Curl. So this could have been a perfect storm, uh, partly your DNA and the fungal infection and also the fact that you were smoking for so many years. Wow. I'll just clip a little bit of this toenail. We'll just take a sample. Ow, ow. Don't worry. My concern is that Tina has left this bunion untreated for too long and when the bunion gets really bad, it becomes arthritic. At that point, you can't really fix the bunion. I don't know if anybody can help me. It might be too bad. So clearly, Tina's been dealing with a host of issues. And I heard that you actually have a jar. And anytime you have a spare quarter, you've been putting that quarter in the jar. Yes, we have. To hopefully be able to fix your, your teeth. How much money do you have now? I think the last time that we counted was um, a little over 200 I believe. $200 dollars towards quarter. the procedure. Yes. So I know you're here today for some hope, and I want to start with you, Dr. Kasrabadi. What did you find, and, and what can be done? Yeah, we, what we found is Tina's uh, feet are indeed infected with fungus, and she has a severe bunion on her feet, uh, which requires shaving and pinning of the bone. And based on our consult yesterday, uh, I think you're a perfect candidate for my procedure. And um, I'll be more than happy to do that procedure for you. Oh my God. Dr. Madahi, again, a lot, of, a lot of issues I know in Tina's mouth, but what did you find and, and what hope is there? Uh, so what I found is that because she's had so many missing teeth in the back, the whole point of reference of the bite is gone. She's not able to chew on her back teeth. The bite is too far closed. And the one remaining back tooth is broken. And what has to be done is that the whole mouth has to be restored. And I've done many celebrity makeovers. And I cannot think of a more deserving person than Tina with her heart. Oh. And I'm sure that I can do the same thing for her. And the best part of it is we're going to get started right after this show. <laughs> And you're you're going to be strutting and smiling, <laughs> strutting and smiling. <clears throat> Gentlemen, can't thank you enough because the other best part of all of this is they're offering their services to you completely free of charge. Okay. So that jar of money you have, <laughs> use that to do something nice for yourself because you deserve it. Yeah. Thank you. Oh, thank you, doctors.